will not stumble. We ask in the name of your only begotten Son, our Lord and Savior Jesus. And we all say amen, 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 amen. and amen. You may be seated. What about the other son? Somebody say, what about, what about the other son? The son? We're so in tune and love to hear about the prodigal son. But what about the other son? Now, we read in the Bible, and I want us to all like our sister said, and we just thank God for you this morning. She said that she learned that not to put a whole lot of other stuff, but to use God's word. Do we all agree that God's word is the un, let's say, adulterated, unadulterated word of our Father, our Heavenly Father? I think um, 2 Timothy 3, 16, and 17, it tells you that the word is good for correction. It is good for structure, instruction. So we all agree that God's word is the last, has the last say. And we are to use his word. Now if we would go back to this other son, Listen to what the other son is doing. Now this brother has come home and this brother said over in one of the other verses, he said, Father, I have sinned against heaven. He says, and I am not even worthy. Amen. Not even worthy. Now this shows humility. Are we humble? Or are we like the other son? When he heard of this celebration and he heard the going on, he said to his, the, the Bible said he was angry. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. Said he was angry, I didn't say it. The Bible said he was angry yes. and he talked to his father with contempt. Yes. Now he was angry and he was very upset. Now, anger is something that we got to be careful about. Because anger leads to a whole lot of other things. The Lord uh, let me see in the Bible what anger does. And I looked up some of the things in the Strong's Bible reference. And it said anger is connected with pride. Malice. Blasphemy. Evil speaking and clamor, cruelty, strife. And he said, all of these things brings punishment. So we better be careful with our anger. Sometimes we get angry like the other son, and we begin to tell people peace of our mind. Maybe that's why we don't have much left. Because if you keep telling somebody peace of your mind, you ain't gonna have much left. That's right. <laughs> but we are quick to tell people off. That's right. But Bible tells us that we are to be slow to anger. That's right. Hallelujah. Over in Proverbs it says, you want to look it up? Look at Proverbs 14, 29. It says that you, we must be slow to anger. Yes. Proverbs 12, 16 speaks of a fool's wrath. The Bible calls an angry man a fool. Because he's acting very foolish when he's angry. He says things that he should not say. He says things that he will be sorry for later. That's the reason why we got to be careful when we get angry. You can't go around telling people off. Now, this other son, when he got angry, he talked very contempt to his father. He said to his father, he said, all these many years, I have been serving you, and I never transgressed, and you ain't never given me no goat that I can celebrate. It's like the nerve of you. I've been here, I did this and I did that, but you gonna do something for somebody who spent your money yes. on these hearts and then it's like, I'm not going to 
coming in there. Uh -huh. I'm not going to celebrate with you. Uh -huh. We got folks in the church that won't celebrate with you. Uh -huh. They won't celebrate your happiness. Uh -huh. They won't celebrate your joy. They won't celebrate what God has done for you. Uh -huh. Because there's anger and there's jealousy. Yeah. That's right. That's right. God said, what about the other son? We relate to the prodigal son. Because why? The prodigal son went out there and did his thing. How many of you, don't raise your hand, went out there and done your thing? <laughs> Just like the prodigal son. You did your own thing. Like the song says, I did it my way. And then you can relate. But when it comes to the other son, you don't want to face what you are holding in your heart because see, even though that son was there with the father even though that son served his father even though that son said, I never transgressed that son had malice in his heart that son had anger in his heart I didn't say it, the Bible said if you got anger in your heart towards somebody else the Bible, let, let me tell you what it said right here. It said, anger, insult, is the same as murder. Yeah. Did you hear what I said? Yeah. If you're angry with your brother for no cause, mm -hmm. and he had no cause, even though the world might say he had a cause because, well, he was entitled, so the world would say, oh, he might have been entitled to do, to have, to get angry because, why, he was there. He don't have no reason to get angry because why? It ain't his money. It's not his property. Yes. It's the father's belongings. And the father can do what he wants with his money, with his property. So it was not his. And he had no reason for getting angry. And the Bible says that his anger, his contempt to his father was just as bad as the property. And that he needed to repent of his sin. You cannot get angry in your heart and say and do what you want and think that it's all right. Let me tell you about the, about the 18th chapter. You can turn to 18, 11. The Pharisees, the Bible compared that other son uh -huh. to the Pharisee. Right. Now the Pharisee stood and prayed to God. It says, I, you hear that I again? Uh -huh. I thank you that I am not like the other. Go ahead. I fast twice a week. Mm -hmm. I give my tithes of all I possess. Mm -hmm. Did you hear that I? Mm -hmm. I did this and I did that. Mm -hmm. And then the tax collector far off, mm -hmm. like that prodigal son, he said, God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Yes. Mm -hmm. If you're not humble, if you don't have humility, if you think that because you in the church, the Pharisees thought they were all right too. The Pharisees thought that they were all right. They thought that they were pure religious people. And they fasted and they gave their tithe and they did all the things that they thought would save them. But the Bible says that salvation don't come that way. 